It's a big risk. It's a huge risk. No one's been there. We don't know where we're going. It could be a really good discovery, but it could be a complete myth. This one's on. Go, 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 go! Ross and Tom have been, you know, two of my biggest heroes growing up. I think Tom's the best ever at pipeline. Ross, there he is, he's taking off in massive waves. No one could take their eyes off him. Communication kind of works like this. No, go, 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 go! No, no, what? Ah! In, in a sense, we have a good marriage. Oh! Oh! Hang on! Our holy grail is to find new spots that have never been surfed. Yeah, it's striking now. We're just going out of the unknown. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still looking for that wave that's going to say, that's the biggest wave you're ever going to ride. This is not fun and games. This is a very, very serious operation in a very, very dangerous environment. I think Tom's psyche's changed on this whole thing. He sort of spent a lot closer time to his three girls. It became a girl, <laughs> almost. I'm turning 50, and I'm looking at life a lot different. It's too windy. There's going to be 50 knots of wind. It's certainly going to be big. It's a mutant of a wave. It's really, really scary. 80 k's out to sea. If someone gets hurt. With all this knowledge, the fact is there's a gap there, and that's Mother Nature. Surfing big waves is not about how ripped your abs are or how much you bench press. I think it's about your nerve. Oh, look at this! Look at this! Oh, I think they've both lived a few lives. They've lost a few lives. You know, if they've got nine, they started, they're down to one or two each, mate. Chilean outpost village of Arica.